I renamed this ship HMAS Sydney. May God bless all who sail in her. Lord Hall, <coughs> Commander in Chief, my Lord Mayor, my Lords, ladies and gentlemen. It is indeed a great pleasure and an honoured privilege for me here today to represent the Australian Government and its people and accept <coughs> this ship, this aircraft carrier, which has been handed over by Lord Hall. Hey, a great day for Australia. And it will be, if I may say so, a practical <coughs> example that we're living in, a, in days when talk is one thing, but deeds is far more important. And this ship will be evidence of the fact that the Australian government <coughs> has proved and shown its willingness to undertake its responsibility in connection with the defence of its own shores, to relieve as far as it's practicable for it to do so the heavy burden which the United Kingdom has carried so long in connection with its navy and the defence of British possessions throughout the world. And still further, it is evidence, practical evidence, of a determination of the government and the people at the same time to carry its responsibility in the sense of regional defence, which and may God bless all who sail in her. Hip, hip, hip.